so listen, we're going to jump in, Mark. We're going to kind of do a little walk through your, uh, your, your time in the business. But before that, we're going to talk about you and Kurt. And I want to know from both of you, when you first met in 1996, you're both in the 1996 Summer Olympics, but how did you guys first meet, Mark? No, no. I, I met Kurt in 95. Okay. At the uh, Olympic Training Center. Nice. Uh, he came to a wrestling camp. And, you know, it was a big deal. You know, they was like, oh, man, this dude, you know, he won the Olympic trials and da, da, da. And I, I was like, man, like, I, I want to see him. And they was like, well, we, they were right next to us. <laughs> like, we were wrestling and weightlifting was connected by, like, a building, like, a, like double doors. So, like, I, I remember going over there one day and this guy, he's a, um, um, I think he passed away. I'm I'm a guy named Mark Kerr. Mark, he's he's still alive. Yeah. Is he still alive? Yes, he is. Yeah. Okay. So Mark Kerr was like, Yeah, strong man, we got somebody for your ass. Yeah, you I bet you can't hold him. And I was oh. like, What are you talking about? And he was like, We got man, this dude can move. Yeah, you gotta see if you can hold him down. <laughs> and Kurt showed me, like, he was like, Well. This how you, uh, you know, like I had never done, I had never wrestled before. I didn't know a seat belt yeah. from a damn shoulder strap. And they like showing me how to put him in a, in a uh, how to hold on to him. Yeah. And it was like, he did a sit out, like rock won't rock and was, and was standing in front of me. I was like, damn, how you do that? It was like magic. <laughs> like I had never seen nobody move that quick before. And I thought that if I grabbed something, it was, I'm holding it forever. <laughs> and that was not the reality. You know what, Mark? He pretty much ruled the Olympic Training Center. He was, he lived there. So he was there every day, okay. all, all year. And yeah. we all came in for a couple of weeks, every few months. So right. Mark was there and he pretty much ruled the place. Everybody knew who he was and he was Mr. Popularity. He oh. was. He was. I love. I love that dude, and he was tough. I I wish that um, he had better circumstances and better people around him. Uh, he's one of those guys that kind of I felt like slipped through the cracks because of not having the disciplined people around him. Kurt, so Mark, you heard him. You're absolutely right.